do because people can drag you and drag your business and it can affect your customer base. So what do you have to say about situations? Because I see some people, you will come on social media and be insulting somebody with your business page. <laughs> like it's Hi guys, I am Celebrity Shemola in the building and you're on the Opinionated Show on Prime Rock CTV. And excitingly enough, we have somebody very, very, very special to introduce to you today. She's a fashion icon, a goddess of beauty, a drama queen. I don't know, you know, let me, let me know, let me know, throw the old hype outside. Do you get it? We have Safina Spark. Creative director of Sparks Teaches. So you know what? I will allow you to introduce yourself very well. But trust me, guys, you don't know what is about to hit you today. Mm -hmm. So Safina, tell us, tell us something about you. Okay, you so um, like she said, I'm creative director of Sparks Teaches. I am fashion inclined, and I love everything trendy mm. and anything that has to do with African prints. Just know that I'm there. I can see it on your like, dress. I am there. If I'm not there. I really like oh, your thanks. dress, thanks, though. Thanks. and I like the uh, work you did on your face. That's drama. I mean, I, what did I say? Drama queen herself. It's great to have you, yes, Athena. So today's episode, right? We're going to be talking about something that is going on recently everywhere on social media: yeah. clout chasing. <laughs> the way you allow a lot of Nigerian jammies, like you have a lot of things to say. So clout chasing. What do you uh, think about clout chasing? Huh. At this point. There is nothing to think of cloud chasing because it is everywhere. Mm -hmm. You look left, there's somebody chasing, chasing clouds. Somebody. Yes. You so look right, there's another thing. There's there. a big cloud in front, in front that this person is chasing. Yeah. And you want to look ahead and mind your business. And then mm. you bring it to your face. Everywhere. You must see something somewhere. Everyone everywhere. So are you telling me you you don't stuff. chase clouds on social media? We 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 no not uh, on social media. Uh, even if I like to sprinkle small drama in the comment sections, uh, I don't like. So you're yeah, one of them. I don't like all front dramas because I try to avoid them as much as possible. But mm -hmm. I do a little drama in the comment sections, you know. Just in my opinion, I don't really like. I like violence, but I don't like violence. God is so, a violence. So, <laughs> here and there, you know. Do you like JLB? Just out, out of the box, do you like JLB? Just love her. Because you mm. said you like violence, and that's like the, the goddess of violence. Mm. <laughs> I push JLB. Oh, I see. I you would work JLB. You would know a I JLB fan JLB. when you see a fan. <laughs> <laughs> you would know one when you see oh, one, actually. I'm, I'm a big fan of JLB. Oh, that's cool. She don't care. Oh, Honestly, don't care. he or she and doesn't I like care. I, I like the fact that he or she just speaks. And I still like mind. the fact that the person has managed to say mm. anonymous. So, even if we have a death on this person, you don't know it is this person. You can't catch, so you can't catch he this person. He or she just goes about his or her mm. business carefree mm. and still being careful at the same time. I yeah. enjoy that animosity. Interesting. So, I personally, about clout chasing here, yeah, so this is when you're trying to put things online on social media, right? To so just become more famous, either through the comment session or dragging this person or doing this or that. But personally, I don't really enjoy cloud chasing sometimes because I yeah it can be it can be really draining it can be really because draining. you have to keep up. That's the if thing. If you don't keep up, you lag behind, and if you lag behind, mm. everything turns back to you, and people start dragging you again. Even if now you bring this to come safe. Yeah. Now we bring this to mm. and no complete them. Why no give them the balance when they expect? Good. Trust me, there's someone that's coming back to pull me out. Honestly, right. and I feel like the indoor of the person that is actually chasing clouds is different from what the person like. You go out there, you want to just catch crews, and everybody knows you. Everybody. Into something else. But inside your room, you are a whole, you're a whole <laughs> different person. You're probably even crying, and you're worse than the thing you're posting out media. there. Of course. I feel like it's, it's you pretty, don't it's see pretty what dangerous. Going through on the outside, all you see is what they want you to, to see. see. So, are you like that? So, on well, the inside, you're a different person from who you are. So, I'm media. dramatic, mm. but I only bring a little of my drama mm. to, to social media. But mm. let's just say I'm dramatic. I, don't yeah, I, I know, I know you're a drama queen. Mm -hmm. I know so, that for sure. And I recently saw um, that video when this um, whole lucky girls and dog thing happened. Yeah. And there was a particular lady that came out and was saying that oh yeah, she does yes, it for this yes, with yes, so much yes. confidence. And now she's 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 paying the price because she's yeah, every day she's so. trying to upload a video of her saying she was just trying to catch crews. Mm. 
And I feel like no, people will now, now people will pick this information and take it more than you have said. I, I read this morning that sleep. she's dead and she died of infection. I'm like, oh. what's going on? She, she might not actually be dead. That's the thing. Yeah. So but is it worth it at the end of the day? She already chest cloud. So mm. like I said, if you don't have the chest to carry it, rest. But if you feel you have the energy, like you were born for it, go for it. Make sure it's paying you. Really? If they don't pay you, now they lose. Yes. Make sure, make sure it pays you. If it's not paying you, if clout is not paying you, you are losing. Mm. Because at the end of the day, you will come back alone to face this thing in your closet. Like, that's and you're crying thing. alone. Everybody does not know that you are crying. That's the thing. They will leave you. See these people that are giving you ginger, all this, especially these celebrities that you have fans. in social media, if my data finish, I don't know how you, I don't know how you survive this. But it's not my data, my data goes... Oh, yeah, I don't know how you deal with these things behind. I Honestly, don't know. True, true. So if you cannot chase it alone, <laughs> you're all the best. Sure. So I saw a recent news about um, someone that was that came out to talk about. Um, I think they were they were probably dragging her about. Um, she's exposing her underwear. Something, something, something around there. Because sometimes all these news just give me a headache. And I see a lot of news about pant or no pant, and then you have to come out and defend yourself for some reason. <laughs> Yes, but I feel like sometimes I feel like you don't have to explain yourself sometimes. But because I feel like the pressure of oh I want to make more money from this gist, so I have to come out and explain myself. But well, I feel you like know, you, you know that to. she is already this person in question or these people in question. Mm. They are already at the forefront of this thing. Yeah. So I like I said, they have to keep up. They have to defend. They have to explain. They have to let everybody know. There are some people that are rooting for them. So those people that are rooting for them now, if you're rooting for me, I have to give you reasons yes. as to why you should root for root me for or me. reasons like things you should you should hold on to. Mm. So that tomorrow, if you have to defend me, you can say, oh, she said she did this, she didn't do this. So you use that one as a defense. Mm. If not, you would not have anything to say to I defend you. You just keep saying she did not, she did not. Oh yeah, where is your proof of she did not? You don't have anything to bring up and say that I said I did not. So are you saying that every every time now, once somebody says something about you, you have to respond to it? You don't have to respond. Mm. But like I said, Clear your name there, is a, there is a very high chance that, in short, at this point, at yeah. the rate at which things are going on social media, there's a 98% chance that somebody is waiting for you to say something. Mm, mm, Even true. under the comments, in the comment section of somebody now, mm, mm-hmm. I might just comment like, I might say, this is totally not worth your time or something. I'm just airing my opinion because I feel like maybe on the norms, I wouldn't even reason this. You will now see somebody that will come and from, from nowhere. As it's not, not your fly. business anymore. <laughs> or since it's not worth your time, why not find something to do with your time? Like, they're not attacking me for saying, for any wasted opinion. your time or something. Mm. So, as much as I know, I will sprinkle the violence <laughs> that I know how to just small like this on top and go. If because if you respond yeah. to my comments, I will not answer you. Oh, so yeah, you are the category of people that when they respond to comments, you will not respond. If just you say something that doesn't there. go well with me, and you need, you need more. I did not hear what you said. <laughs> but if you say something that I find interesting, you I might, I might attack, respond. attack. It might not, might not be an attack. It might be, you might be, you might be relating to my point. Mm. So I might just still, you know, say something about it again. But on a fight. I'm so what's what's like one fight. moment where you actually like reply? Probably you commented on something and someone attacked you, or you posted something and someone attacked you. And what did you do in that particular situation? Can I you can't think of remember anything? anyone of late because of late. If I have to comment under a post, it is maybe it is either extremely funny or something, something or. It is a very serious case, like this one now that out that is going around um, the pan series, so to say. Okay, it's just <laughs> the pan series. The pan okay, series, so to say. The only thing I commented was I think I said I me mean, I just walk up past her, and then somebody said, "Hey, if you come sit down for another and I say the same ah. day, that way you take cancer, now you take cancer. <laughs> so when your own finish, my own finish, all of us. Nice so one, close it there. I've not seen any response since then, so person don't fear. I don't have that energy. Call. I don't have even the best response. I don't think I will answer the person because person's mission has practically I'm still failed. Trying to drink enough water, enough water to be healthy. So <laughs> I, I know I won't. I won't do that. I don't have that energy. But then I hear people say that people that are into a particular business, for example, you that you're into fashion, right? Mm-hmm. You're always like be careful of what you post, what you use your account to post. Be careful of 
things you do because people can drag you and drag your business and it can affect your customer base so what do you have to say about situations like, because i see some people you will come on social media and be insulting somebody with your business page <laughs> like do you have sense you, want to do things, you can do them with your personal page mm-hmm. such that even if they might still find out your business people make sure you're doing them with your personal page so that when the shit is going down you can either close down the page or just ignore the person and move on with your business it doesn't matter even if they come to your business page and start traveling so long as you didn't start it with your business page mm. i don't think it's actually just ignore see no stress i like drama but i don't like stress mm. i think there's a difference word i won't do this word that i will not do it but i will sprinkle drama Mm, I see. This small violence and this stress. It's like following this lover now. Yeah. And then this lover posts something. Mm. And then you come and bad comment something that is not violent. See? Mm. Those will be their hungry and thirsty. This lover fans oh, are they are waiting you for you. Me. I think I was just going through that page a yeah. couple of minutes ago before we came here. Yeah. And I saw where this lover went back to screenshots. A com- someone's comment where the mm. person said um, about the celebrity that was having mental health issues yeah. and the rest uh, of them. I think Jenny like Rose. Yeah. So um, the person now said this person is a public figure. Does not mean um, um, her personal business has to be in the public, clinical, clinical, mm. private, her page, do this one. You don't have to do you know, that. Her life is on. Just never like just got it. So said, this is the comment I've been waiting for. <laughs> That's it's just that time. Have been waiting. It's and then you time. go, you check the comments under that particular post, and then you see the bash. Attacking each other. Attacking with the best them to come. If you check their Telegram channel, yeah. you see where they always um, do this whole thing where they say continue violence. Yes, stop violence. violence. Let peace in the rain. Yes, she's always doing that poll, or he's always doing that poll. Violence, let violence continue. Rating at 80 something. Oh the other my ones God. are 2%, 3%, 5%. <laughs> I'm like, I like, I actually like you guys energy. now. I, I like the energy, but tread carefully if you are going on some particular pages. Seriously. Be, be walking, be walking yeah. thinly as you're walking on certain Or oh, this one, or oh, these two people, this one's house that just got demolished. Mm. The other one is dancing, and everybody's telling the one that is dancing. That uh, you shouldn't be dancing, the downfall, can you go, can you go? I feel like this thing sometimes gets fans are the ones that actually <laughs> make these things get into these people's heads. See, but some people, of them don't even intend to do this thing. And we we'll still forget that they are humans, and some yes. of these fans would react exactly the same, same way. way this person reacted. You come into our and they will judge you, same. they will judge you to be honest. Hands down, real bad, real bad. Mm. That's like if you don't have the chest for it, like you said, honestly, I don't even blame some of the celebrities that don't put their lives out there because mm. they know that if we need to start it, you have to keep up. Like, you actually to some have to keep point, up. there's no limit because mm. you need to start it, even if you don't bring this thing out. So, someone is going to help someone you pick it, it. like your life is already a public you got married, you don't want to post your husband, somebody is going to fish it out. out. Is it that they will come they don't engage you. Something. you don't want to show us your ring. Somebody, Somebody will bring it, out. bring it out. And tell us the jeweler that they bought it from. Honestly, that's, that's that the bad. thing. Your life is not secret. Yeah. Do you, would you now say, to, to just um, have this up, would you now say that being a celebrity sometimes is like, it means like all your business is out there, like all your business. Because now, like you said, some, sometimes you don't want to say some certain things, but it's real there. They will fish you out. So are you, oh, as a celebrity now, is, is it is it safe to say? Because it gets scary for some other people. Like if I get famous, some people start digging my life story outside or something, something, something. So do you feel like it's a safe space to say, well, I want to be a celebrity and nobody would actually find information about me? Or you just come out as a celebrity and do Because you're also a celebrity. Your brand is a celebrity. <laughs> You so, want to be a celebrity and you don't want your business to be out there. It is very impossible. Mm. See, even if you don't put your business out there, there are one or two persons that know you really deep mm. or to some extent self that by the time they see that um, somebody is about to talk about this person. Some willingly give out these information about you. Mm. While some, I think they pay some or something like that. So. That's how we are, we are making life choices. We're not perfect. We we'll make mistakes. We we'll do some Very things true. that we regret at the end of. Just Very true. Be at peace with yourself so that when these things come out, you, you know that you settled it with yourself. And if you just come on your mind for social media, you just have one house. At the end of the day, it's still like that. 
at the end of the day. It's not going to rain forever. It's not rain forever. forever. How many am I that is raining forever? <laughs> <laughs> it's always, it's always, it's always come and go. So in conclusion, one very important thing I picked from you today is you can chase clouds if it pays you money. But as you are starting, have mm. the chest to carry it and mm. the things that come with it and ensure that you are at peace with yourself, right? Exactly. So, so whatever it is, come whatever out things, tomorrow, yes, exactly. you are very, very safe. You're not coming out, breaking down every second of social media, my mental health, blah, 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 blah. blah. Because there are people that will, they will open they your don't shelf, but they don't care. They go through worse, they do worse, but it's the person that is out there, they want to put fingers into their eyes, they want to cast stone on you. So ensure you have the chest to take it and you have peace with yourself, right? So that you yeah. can handle these things right. Handle the pressures, be safe, be fine. You still cry, yo. <laughs> you still cry. Yes, you still cry. You still yeah, down. I feel you like we have their down moments. Still, they all do, they all do, they always do. Some of them will not tell you, I'm, I'm, I'm grateful, I'm fine now. Some of them will tell you, I had a rough time. Because, I mean, even we say that I'm not celebrating. Mm. With what life feels at us, you still have the downtime, so mm. you don't even have to be a celebrity self to go through these downtimes. You see people being dragged along celebrities, like regular people, people yeah, being dragged, dragged alongside celebrities really because they're involved in this story one way or another. Yes, that's they true. Still go back and back. That's and very fine. correct. Just try last, last, fine. last, last. Make sure you don't take your own too serious to the extreme. And God, don't go and do. You get. Be all right. Like I said, if you can't handle it, just log off. So sh- thank don't you. Don't see anything. Don't let anybody give you the gist. Even if they want to be Block your ears. Get out. <laughs> Block that your is. ears. So yeah, just this day is different. If you cannot stay away from your phone, you watch Netflix on your phone. She's giving like you options, me. guys. <laughs> <laughs> or you go out. So I'm going to do something with your time, right? You go out and let me see counter. She should be just for you. You turn Add around. You, <laughs> <laughs> you turn around and say thank you. <laughs> Everywhere. Oh, but thank you. Thank you so much, Safina. Yeah, so if you, you are out there too. chasing clouds, sometimes I feel you guys should actually take it slow sometimes. So people remember like they have hearts and you also can make such mistakes. Mm-hmm. So please, let's be taking it easy on people sometimes. We're not perfect, right? Mm-hmm. That's another thing I took from Safina today. It was so great having you. you and please guys shop from Safina Safina Sparks right <laughs> Safina Sparks tissues, Sparks tissues on Instagram, on Instagram. Yeah. so follow her on Instagram shop from Some her really juicy things are coming out though yeah, she has juicy, 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 juicy things coming out. Start shopping, start getting your money ready until we meet I'm again. Excited. Hopefully, we're going to have you again on this show. We have I, I cannot wait to have you <laughs> again. All right, guys, please don't forget to like, comment, share, follow us on all social media platforms, subscribe on YouTube at Prime Boxy Inc. and follow us on social media on Instagram to be precise. And please, in the comment section, let us know what you think about cloud chasing. Tell us. So. Tell us something. Like, what do you think? Is it good? Is it bad? Does it? Have you done it? What experience have you had? Did it pay you? Did it pay you? How did you cope with it? Did it enter? You know. Let's keep this conversation buzzing till we meet again on another exciting episode. Safina and Salimisi Shemola, we are signing out.